I'm Karen Dalva. I'm one of the co-founders and the CEO at No Isolation. I think everyone has experienced loneliness. Uh, I definitely have, and I, uh, I just, it's such a vulnerable feeling. We've created this telepresence robot called AV1. Uh, it's specially made for kids that are suffering from long-term illness, because we saw that these kids were unable to participate in their everyday life at school, at birthday parties, at field trips. And we wanted to give them a tool that would let them be there. Uh, so we, uh, we created AV1 and it works as their eyes, ears and voice wherever they cannot go themselves. AV1 is the result of a quite long design process that started with a mom who had lost her daughter and 12 years previously and she was, uh, she was fighting for the right of kids with cancer uh, to be at school and she was telling me about this issue of, of her daughter not being able to participate and, or be with her friends for the last two years of her life. But we went out there and we started asking the kids that was suffering from long-term illness and their parents, what, what do you want to achieve? What are you missing out on? And how can we help? And after going back and forth, we found that they really needed to just be able to participate, just to be there and to talk to everyone in an everyday life setting is, is so much more powerful than getting a weekly visit from your best friend. We figured that the design should be super sleek, super simple, uh, kind looking, but not too cute. And it should be possible for the kids to dress it up as their own personality, like give the robot a piece of themselves. And, and I think we really succeeded in that. It's quite incredible seeing how you can, you can actually change a life. Loneliness is not an easy thing to talk about. It's a feeling that I believe most of us has felt at some point, and it's, it's hard to define for yourself when you're lonely. All major life changes exposes you to loneliness at a high degree, so getting a divorce or moving to a new city or getting a new job or being diagnosed with anything really, it will it will change the status quo and that will leave you vulnerable to loneliness, uh, which in turn can, can lead to so many things like depression and, <laughs> and extra stress. And, and it's a bad loop where it's hard to get out on your own because you're, you're in this on your own. So I, uh, I, I definitely think that the world needs to continue looking for better solutions. I think tech can be a huge part of that solution, but uh, yeah, the government across the world needs to address it. As we've, as we've gone along, the issue has just grown and we are becoming painfully aware that the world needs solutions.